Please sit down. As Vice-Chancellor of the University, it's my pleasure to welcome you to this afternoon's ceremony for the School of Computer Science and the School of Engineering and Technology. May I introduce the platform party and welcome on my immediate left, Mr. James Noble Rogers, who will be receiving an honorary degree of Master of Education. And on my far left, Ms. Sal Jarvis, Dean of the School of Education. On my immediate right, Professor William Cloxon, Dean of the School of Computer Science. And on my far right, Professor Reza Sudute, Dean of the School of Engineering and Technology. And finally, at the table on my extreme right, Mrs. Harrison, uh, uh, Sharon Harrison Barker, the academic registrar of the university who carries in the mace which you see sitting in front of me and which, as I understand it, is for my personal protection. Of course, can I also welcome, most importantly, all those who are about to graduate and, of course, their friends, relatives and families to this afternoon's ceremony. We'll now proceed with the conferment of awards and I have pleasure in calling upon Ms. Sal Jarvis to read the citation for conferment of the honorary award of Master of Education on Mr. James Noble Rogers. Thank you. The University of Hertfordshire has a long and successful history in the training and development of teachers and other educators. We believe that universities such as ours have a vital role to play in this sector, ensuring that future generations of teachers are trained to the highest possible standards. The University's Council for the Education of Teachers, or USET for short, is an important organisation in helping universities to maintain that goal. USET acts as a national forum and network for its members, which includes universities and colleges. It promotes high standards in teacher development and aims to enhance the profession's status. It also contributes to the educational debate and research and works closely with the government. As you might imagine, liaising between universities and the Department of Education takes great diplomacy, sharp negotiating skills, the patience of a saint, and of course, a sense of humor. As USET's direct executive director for more than a decade, James Noble Rogers has worked tires tirelessly in this capacity. He has acted as a critical friend and strategic partner of the government and other statutory agencies, challenging policy when required. He has argued for a collegial, open and collaborative approach to teacher education and has kept up a relentless scrutiny of the impact that ever-changing policy has on recruitment numbers and the quality of qualified teachers. James is a tenacious champion of university and school partnership in teacher education and has played a key role in improving communications between universities, never an easy task, by sharing good practice through regular updates, conferences, seminars and publications. Over the last few years, he's negotiated with government departments, ensuring that the current trend towards school-based teacher education still includes the contribution of universities. One of his great achievements was establishing an alliance between USET and other key partners, including the National Association for School-Based Initial Teacher Training, Universities UK, and the British Educational Research Association. This has helped to make sure that all providers of teacher education have influence in order to maintain a high quality of newly qualified teachers entering the profession. Calm under pressure, reassuringly professional, yet always personable, James is equally comfortable giving evidence to MPs at education select committees, addressing teachers, liaising with charities or writing articles and papers for various national publications, journals and newspapers. I'd love to think that James has developed many of his skills during his formative years as a humanities student here at Hertfordshire, 
or Hatfield Polytechnic, as we were known then. He tells us that he distinctly remembers coming for his interview in 1980 and being told that, despite not quite having the best grades, we were willing to give him a chance. Everything that he has achieved since then, he says, has been built on that. We are very proud to think that we gave James the firm foundation he needed for what has been a very successful career. After leaving Hatfield, James went on to gain a Master's in Philosophy from Nottingham and a postgraduate diploma with distinction from City University London. In 1987, he became a civil servant, working for the Department of Education in its various guises and the Teacher Training Agency for 13 years. In 2000, he joined the Royal National Institute of Blind People as Head of Governance. James made a remarkable impact during his four years there, introducing a new membership and government sy governance system that ensured authority within the organisation rested individually with blind and partially sighted people themselves. This was described by BBC Radio 4 as the most strategic change at the RNIB for more than two decades. James is an honorary fellow of Wolverhampton University and today we add to that accolade, thanking him for his services to the public sector and in his work to improve teacher development in this country. Vice-Chancellor, in recognition of his contribution to education, I ask you to confer the honorary degree of Master of Education on Mr James Noble Rogers. I now call upon Mr. Noble Rogers to address the Assembly. First of all, I'd like to thank the authorities of the University for conferring this great honour honor, honor on me here today and in the awesome St. Albans Abbey where I've spent many, many hours over the years and I've visited on countless occasions. Special thanks to the Vice-Chancellor and to Sal for the kind wo words they've just spoken. If, you'd like to, if you would indulge me, I'd like to begin by going back in time a few years, 25 years to be exact, um, into to 1980, when I was working in a betting shop about a mile from here in London Road in St Albans. Um, the shop isn't there anymore, but some of it's, the, the family firm does still have shops in the city. As Sal said, at the time, I was a proud holder of two rather modest A-levels, one of which I'd obtained at night classes, um, attending what is now called Oakland's College while working during the day. At some stage, I decided that helping people win money, my employers, of course, rather than their customers, was not what I wanted to do the rest of my life. So I applied to take a degree at what was then the Hatfield Polytechnic and is now, of course, the University of Hertfordshire. As Sal said, I distinctly remember being interviewed for a place on the humanities degree and being told that, despite my modest A-levels, the Polytechnic was willing to take a chance and offer me a place. Whatever I've achieved since then has been either a direct or an indirect result of being given that chance. And it's for that reason why I feel so grateful to this university for the education and grounding that I received and why I feel so particularly honoured at being here today. The quality of education I received here between 1980 and 1983 was exceptional. I don't know if any of those responsible are still at the university, I somehow doubt it. At least one of them became a member of parliament and even at my, in my day was active on the political scene. But collectively, they allowed me to understand in some depth, for example, Descartes' meditations, Kant's critique of pure reason, which I remember going through on a page-by-page -page basis, and Karl Popper, to name just a few, writers who I still draw on today. I enjoyed, in fact, my three years at Hatfield Polytechnic because it was so much that I stayed on for a further year working as potman in what was then called the Font Bar, which I'm rather disappointed to say I understand is now closed, but they were great days. I have, over the last 11 years, been privileged to work with colleagues from this university and other universities up and down the country on what is now my day job of supporting all the universities in the United Kingdom involved in teacher education and education research. 
Teacher education is at the moment undergoing a period of dramatic and unprecedented change, some of which is not based on educational need, but more an ideological mindset of some current ministers. But what the University of Hertfordshire is doing, alongside its partner schools, means that it will continue to thrive, continue to supply schools in the area with exceptionally able and well-trained teachers, and continue to make an essential contribution to the knowledge base of teacher education through its research act activities. Of that, I have absolutely no doubt. When I last received a degree from this institution in the Hutton Hall in 1984, my mother Joyce was in the audience, and I'm pleased to say that she's here again today, along with her husband Ron, who also used to work on what is now the site of the Education Department in its previous incarnation. And I'm also delighted that my wife, B. Noble Rogers, who is one of the country's acknowledged experts in teacher education, is here as well. Finally, I'd like to congratulate everyone receiving their awards today. You've graduated from a brilliant university and feel deservedly proud. Thank you. Uh, we shall now receive the graduates of the School of Computer Science and the School of Engineering and Technology. The graduates are presented by a senior member of academic staff from their school. The awards, sponsorships and prizes that have been given in the final year of study will be read out prior to the graduates' name. And I first call upon Dr. Rennie uh, to Berghorst uh, to make the presentations. School of Computer Science, Doctor of Philosophy. Sylvia Enabog Pekka has been awarded the degree of Doctor of Philosophy in recognition of a program of work entitled The Genomics of T1D Diabetes, Susceptibility Regions and the Effect of Regulatory SNPs. Vice Chancellor, Doctor Sylvia Enabong Pekka. Doctor of Philosophy. Santanu Kumar Dash has been awarded the degree of Doctor of Philosophy in recognition of a program of work entitled Adaptive Constraint Solving for Information Flow Analysis. Vice Chancellor, Dr. Santanu Kumar Dash. Doctor of Philosophy, Hock Chai Gang has been awarded the degree of Doctor of Philosophy in a recognition of a program of work entitled Using Multimodal Biodigital Technologies to Support the Assessment of Cognitive Abilities of Children with Physical and Neurological Impairments. Vice Chancellor, Dr. Hock Chai Gang. Doctor of Philosophy. Wo Ding Nye Ming has been awarded uh, the degree of Doctor of Philosophy for a program of work entitled An Efficient Execution Model for Reactive Stream Programs. Vice Chancellor, Doctor um, Wo Ding Nye Ming. Doctor of Philosophy. Thomas Joshua Shippey has been awarded the degree of Doctor of Philosophy in recognition of a program of work entitled Exploiting Abstract Syntax Trees to Locate Software Defects. Vice Chancellor, Dr. Thomas Joshua Shippey.
Masters of Science degree in Artificial Intelligence with Robotics, with distinction, Masood Ahmed. <laughs> Prit Tuntisak. <laughs> Masters of Science degree in Computer Networking, Principles and Practice, Oladutun Kwayam Akinlavi. <laughs> Dimitra Keheyov. <laughs> Mahmoud Yasin Omer. Masters of Science degree in Computer Science, Mystery S M A S Al Mashud. <laughs> Stephen Anthony Beebe. <laughs> With distinction, Anthony William James Cronin. Yotam Mangu. <laughs> Anthony Nawanko. <laughs> Benjamin Ogenevu Obu. With distinction, John Reyes. <laughs> With distinction, Ellen Alex James Rossiter. <laughs> With distinction, Gareth Rolston. Yelena Sinek. <laughs> With distinction, Istvan Pisteri. <laughs> With distinction, Ahmad Yonist. Masters of Science degree in Distributed Data Management, Juliana Opoku Kuvo. <laughs> Masters of Science degree in e learning technology, with distinction and a winner of a university prize, Prishka Suleni Masheka Peramunagama. With distinction, Loretta Lynette Rose. <laughs> Masters of Science degree in Human Computer Interaction. With distinction, Kevin John Holden. <laughs> With distinction, Justin Mifsud. Masters of Science degree in Software Engineering, Christopher Bartolo. <laughs> Zolt Gol. <laughs> Savan Vies.
Master of Engineering degree in Computer Science with first class honours, Marcus Andrew Lee. With first class honours, Adam Luke Rhodes. <laughs> Bachelor of Science degree in Computer Science, Chowdhury M. A. Alam. <laughs> With first class honours, Usman Muhammad Ali. Pasquale Basile. <laughs> Daniel Robert Beavis. <laughs> With first class honors, Alexander Bradbury. With first class honours, Ryan Brooker. <laughs> Sita Burley. <laughs> With first class honours, Dominic Chapman. <laughs> With first class honours, Jamie Lee Coleman. With first class honours, Damien Cummins. <laughs> With first class honours, Thomas Kurd. <laughs> With first class honours, Andrew Eugene De Silva. <laughs> With first class honours, Alexei Christopher Dimitriou. With first class honours, Eleanor Isabella Dimitriou. <laughs> Olawatuin Abiola Faneye. <laughs> Nat Natasha Nuriman Farouk. With first class honours, Dennis Fick. <laughs> With first class honours, Enda Follen. <laughs> Sarunpal Singh Gaffrey. <laughs> Andrew Paul Hartley. With first class honours, Anton John Hassaj. <laughs> Bamdad Hussein Sadet Fard. <laughs> Mariam Iqbal. With first class honours and winner of a university prize, Daniel James Ives. <laughs> Navid Javed. <laughs> Bonnie Kasule Kakande. With first class honours, Muhammad Kamran. <laughs> With first class honours, Scott Kemp. <laughs> With first class honours, Awis Khan. <laughs> J. 
Chandi Kotija. With first class honours, Lorenz Lomida. Joelle David Mason. With first class honours, Joginder Singh Panda. Robert Pierce. With first class honours, Vadet Pervan. Jonathan Joseph Pickett. With first class honours, Louise Putz. With first class honours, Kevin Povathiranadan. With first class honours, Thomas Edward Weeks. Fushbir Rehman. Dimitris Ribikis. With first class honours, Penelope Nasakisi Ricotso. With first class honours, Andre Robu. With first class honours, Graham Rose. With first class honours, Amreen Shiraz Khan. <laughs> Ashley Street. <laughs> Jamal Slazi. Dominic Andrea Smith. With first class honours, George Richard Watts. With first class honours, Zolfo Yilmaz. Bachelor of Science degree in Computer Science with a year abroad, with first class honours, Sam Frederick Taylor. <laughs> Diploma of Higher Education in Computer Science, Antonio Martin de Vera. <laughs> Ali Raza. Sambolo Sender. <laughs> Moet Talal. <laughs> Bachelor of Science degree in Computer Science, Artificial Intelligence, Bogdan Marian Boboaka. <laughs> With first class honors, Alexander Thomas Fraser. With first class honours, Joseph Go. With first class honours, Muhammad Said Hanif. Akrip Hussein. Nafdit Singh Jandu.
with First Class Honours, Kai Leddy. With First Class Honours, Charlie Webster. Seth David Wheeler. With First Class Honours, Stephen Warren. <laughs> Bachelor of Science Degree in Computer Science Networks. With First Class Honours, Muhammad Mustakim Ali. Wasin Al Kakani. <laughs> Sajis Caldera. <laughs> With first class honours, Stephen John Michael Cleary. <laughs> Vikash Danji Hirani. Matthew James Mildenstein. With first class honours, Lee Skip. With first class honours, Jerin Thomas. Rickin Vagela. Bachelor of Science degree in Computer Science, Software Engineering, Muktadiru Ahmed. <laughs> With first class honors, Francesca Maria Ed. <laughs> With first class honors, Harpreet Badach. With first class honours, Emma Chamberlain. With first class honours, James Michael Child. With first class honours, Mark Edward Daniel. Sujoy Day. With first class honours, Hoi Tuan Di. With first class honours, Alistair Lewis Edwards. Stephen F. A. Amubu. Thomas Matthew Farr. With first class honours, Daniel Ferry Dunian. With first class honours, Daniel Hannigan. With first class honours, Anmar Hindi. With first class honours, Mohammed Kabir Hussein. With first class honours, Chirag Jamanadas Paksutamo. Chloe Jennings. <laughs> Chun Wai Leung. <laughs> With, 
With first class honours, Benjamin James Lloyd. With first class honours, Charanjit Mahru. With first class honours, Sohil Divyesh Mansata. With first class honours, Aslan Maksud. With first class honours, Christian Daniel Messer. Kadampan Muralitaran. With first class honours, Walid Mohammed Nawaz. With first class honours, Uchenna Nuanika. Sunny Patel. With first class honours, Cameron James Patterson. With first class honours, Daniel Stephen Pell. Krishnathan Shiu Pillay. With first class honours, Raduku Grigore Puba. With first class honours, Haresh Kishore Rarao. With first class honours, Ryan Thomas Saunders. With first class honours, Jack Robert Tippen. Christopher Isaac Vieira. Ross Watson. With first class honours, Andri Jaferi. With first class honours, Roy Yazbek. <laughs> Bachelor of Science degree in Computer Science, Software Engineering, with a year abroad. With first class honours, Kevin James Suvichyasiri. Bachelor of Science degree in Information Technology, Michael Aluwazen Adeyemo. <laughs> Mutasim Afzal. <laughs> Samson Oluwatobi Oluwadamilare Ajala. Iman Ali Dusti. <laughs> With first class honours, Chandi Gayatri Aranayaka. <laughs> Oladimeji Emmanuel Babayemi. Samson Bajulea. <laughs> J. 
Jerome Marlon Campbell. <laughs> Nile Tobin Kamau Kriri. <laughs> Jessica Sarah Lisa Davies. Jesse Jamal Dixon. Orel Mihai Dragileli. Ebenezer Mofahinto Lua Falola. Palmodu Gasama. With first class honors, Alpesh Gorsia. <laughs> Abdul Hay Kaduria. <laughs> With first class honors, Neelam Bharat Keshwala. Rebecca Ann Knight. <laughs> Mohammed Sadiq Lakani. <laughs> Chanda Peter Lubemba. Leah Naomi Maddox. Aisha Manju. Kenya Cleo Mason Bond. Sanjay Kumar Mahe. With first class honours and winner of a university prize, Arif Ali Mughal. <laughs> Hamza Mughal. AJ Narad <laughs> Stephen Vashira Northy <laughs> Lloyd Obeng Adu <laughs> Akene Dili Chukru William Onuora Henry Anaba Osim. <laughs> Dimitri Papota. <laughs> Hanisha Dilesh Patel. <laughs> With first class honors, Krupa Patel. Shivani Patel. <laughs> Luke Pereira. <laughs> Akil Jumane Philip Ford. <laughs> With first class honors, Jasmine Jamal Qureshi.
Sonamani Rachman. Hamesh Andrew Sagar Rambaran. Bavin Raniga. Ricky Rutherd. With first class honors, Megan Lee Seaman. Mohammed Mahmoud Shafiq Abdullah Shalabi. Rosanna Fatanen Sivarubin. Tanakom Jom Tarizut. Scott Williams. Pamela Javier Alves. Bachelor of Science degree in Information Technology, Business Systems. Jason Nana Kwame Apia Amankwa. <laughs> Hiroshima Bagiwatan Wanti Ariyawata. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> With first class honors, Kiran Hari James Aurora. Zishan Butt. <laughs> Daniel Dadra. <laughs> Paul Anirad Diman. <laughs> With first class honors, Takshita Navin Jinasena. Sophia Johal. Mohammed Rafiq. <laughs> Anojan Sivanantaraja. <laughs> Jamal Upadhyaya. <laughs> Bavik Muji Vasani. Bachelor of Science degree in Information Technology, Entertainment Systems. With first class honors, Tanvir Ahmed. With first class honors, Leonard Anthony Emmanuel. John Green. Joel Joshi. <laughs> Ali Rida Maledina. <laughs> Ali 
Aluka Yodi, Oluyomi Ahmed Alumi. <laughs> Harry James Michael Rolfe. <laughs> Samir Shahi. <laughs> Mohammed Amaruz Zaman. Mohammed Samaruz Zaman. <laughs> Bachelor of Science degree in Information Technology, Web Based Systems, Ashley Brett. <laughs> Sayadali Pumofi. Humayun Rashid Mia. Kristaps Slizens. Bachelor of Science degree in Computer Studies, J. Shivani Takur. School of Engineering and Technology, Bachelor of Science degree in Aerospace Technology with Management, Mark David Kirvin. With first class honors, Liam Macbeth. With first class honours, Kieran McCarran. <laughs> Arthur Ordinac. <laughs> Keys Tarek Rasul. <laughs> With first class honours, Jonathan Michael Peter Riles. <laughs> David Simon. <laughs> Gemma Louise Sullivan. <laughs> Scott James Welsh. Diploma of Higher Education, Emma Marie Percy. <laughs> Bachelor of Science degree in Aerospace Technology with Pilot Studies, Christopher Ricardo Bishop. <laughs> Victoria Garcia Usgate. <laughs> With first class honours and winner of a university prize, Philip Andrew Lodge. With first class honours, Gerald Moko. <laughs> With first class honours, James Stephen Perrett. <laughs> Bachelor of Science degree in Automotive Technology with Management. Ali Abrahim Mohammed Abdelwurf. <laughs> Khalid Ahmed.
Charles Sebastian Corby. <laughs> With first class honours, Luke Mitchell Harris. <laughs> Samuel Hassan. <laughs> Jimmy Huang. Nicholas, Nicholas Eljandro Montodon. <laughs> Ashley John Scales. <laughs> Callum Smith. Bachelor of Science degree uh, in Computer Technology and Networks. Olimide Adi Udan Adi Bayo. With first class honours, Perez Al Tahan. <laughs> Jose Miquel Guadastado Rion. <laughs> Lynette Edwards. Emmanuel Adijemi. <laughs> Bachelor of Science degree in Film and TV Production with Year Abroad. Elidadi Nasadi Senga. Bachelor of Science degree in Motorsport Technology, Aaron Deep Singh Ball. Andrew George Bickerton. Joshua James Brooks. <laughs> 